There you go. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here. If you're new, welcome. Hello, my name is Ling or what you're saying. <laughs> if you don't know, if you don't follow me on Instagram, make sure you do. Benefit, such an amazing brand, took me to Japan. They hosted probably one of the best trips I've ever been on. Like, I'm not just saying that. I actually genuinely mean that because Benefit, they just know how to take care of people when it comes to trip. And there's loads of like fun activities for us to do as well for us influencers. And I just feel like so privileged and so blessed. And I feel like, why not film this video? Why not test out their brand? new brow products because that's what Benefit's known for. I am such a committed Benefit brow user. Like I use precisely my brow for the past I think two years now. Sometimes I dip in and out and use other products from Benefit but Benefit precisely my brow is my jam. However now they've released a brand new product which is called this. This is the Benefit Brow Styler and I thought it would be fun to test it out today because me and Nathan we got loads of things to do today and we're going to be doing samurai training so I thought why not test it out whilst we're out and about and I thought why not combine it into a vlog as well which I hope you guys don't mind it feels so weird to have like no long nails oh my god look how short and fat my fingers are without my acrylics <laughs> before I start the review I'm just going to show you guys like a little quick montage of everything that me and Benefit has been up to so I hope you enjoy It lasts up to 18 hours and I'm gonna try my best to wear it up to 18 hours. Hopefully it will last that long. Usually when I wear makeup for that long, my skin does get a little spotty. So if I do get spots around my eyebrows, don't say I don't help you out. And it's waterproof as well. So that would be really fun. It's really hot in Kyoto right now. So hopefully it's like sweat proof and like, you know, doesn't like mess up my eyebrows. I feel like when it comes to makeup, I don't mind if like a little bit of my eyeliner smudges or a little bit of my mascara smudges. But when that eyebrow smart smudging is it now. Okay, so this is how the products look like. It kind of looks like a wand. It's really cool. So at the top is the pencil. So this looks a little bit like goof proof. If you guys have never seen goof proof before, this is what it looks like. And I am in the shade soft black, I believe. It's soft black? I'm in the shade number six, let's just say that. And the other side, which is really cool, is the powder. Now, I have really oily skin, so the type of people who would wear powders would be someone who has oily skin <laughs> because the powder absorbs the oil and it just helps keep the brows matte now if anybody who suffers from oily skin and they notice throughout the day that eyebrows get a little bit oily and they don't know how to combat that a powder is very helpful if you watch my instagram videos then you know that i always use this i always use a brow setter to set my brows it's just such an important step for me because i have like really long asian straight eyebrow hairs and i need something that keeps them up and also this does help keep the product last a little bit longer on the brows so i will use this because this is like my normal brow routine so i hope you guys don't mind that oh no wait actually i got an idea i will do one side without the brow gel and then i'll do the other side with the brow gel just to compare oh my god yeah yeah so i literally have like 20 minutes to get ready so i'm just gonna do like quickly do my eyebrows and then quickly do my makeup and then i'm gonna go about with our day so a lot of people have been saying that you use the powder first and then you use the pencil side to be honest i feel like when it comes to makeup you can use makeup however you want to use it i personally feel like and benefit please don't kill me when i say this i feel like the pencil side will be a good way to start off especially if you're a beginner at filling in eyebrows because this will help shape the brows and then you go ahead and fill in with the powder but a lot of people have been doing it the other way around they fill in the brows first with the powder and they go ahead and shape it with the pencil which does make sense but i feel like if someone is quite nervous and don't really know how to do eyebrows i feel like shaping them first and then filling them in will be a bit easier so i'm going to shape my eyebrows first and then fill them in i'm going to use my finger to brush up my brow hairs i'm going to follow the natural line of my brows oh yeah 
Now what I like about the pencil side, now I've been playing around with it the past couple of days, is that it's not super pigmented. I don't like it when brow products are like really pigmented and it's like really harsh on the brows. I like my brows to look quite soft and not too like drawn on. And then when I get to the end of my brow hairs, I like to lift the pencil up so it gives off like a soft texture and then same with the top part of the brows as well just going to follow the natural line of my brow hairs and there you go now with the powder side i'm going to shake because there's a little ball in there and this will help cover the stick with the powder now because this is a fresh new packet you do want to kind of take off a little bit of powder so that way when you fill them in it's not too much powder on your brows this is like my favorite part of the process when filling in my eyebrows with this product you can put the stick on your brows you can go back and forth as for when you use pencil or something it just doesn't really work because it's the powder it's able to fill in the brows and the skin as well so it makes your brow hair looks fuller so it looks weird it feels uncomfortable but this is like such an amazing technique to do and that way it ensures that it's able to fill every bit in and no sparse areas just gonna use a spoolie to blend it out and then just gonna go back and fill in the areas cool so i'm gonna do like a natural brow look today because i'm in a rush to get ready so i'm just gonna do like a quick time lapse of my makeup makeup is awesome i'm gonna go out and explore kyoto with you guys and yeah let's see how well this new benefit brow products work so where i am i cannot film but if you follow me on instagram then you know what happened today Okay, right, touch, 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 <laughs> the samurai training experience thingy was so intense my lashes came off so i had to take it off guys lily lashes gone literally this is like 20 quid down the drain quick change i uh you know put on a hat i'm wearing two of my outfits already just on top of each other <laughs> the things i do for instagram pictures so this is the hotel that i am staying i recommend staying here the rooms are ridiculously tiny but it's so like worth it in terms of location and literally right opposite it's a groceries not even like a little corner shop it's a groceries oh yeah we are now gonna go and do like a little kyoto tour a few moments later anyone who has been here know how much walking there is update time on the brows this one is holding up really really well this one's holding up pretty good with that brow gel mm. We will check in a little bit later when I'm sitting down and have a glass of water. Have some delicious crisps. I'm not keeping the stick until I find the bin. I don't want a little. Okay, guys, so it's officially been almost, I think, 10 hours now. It's really late. It's like dark outside. I've had this one since 10 a.m., I believe. My face is so oily. It is actually disgusting, but you know what that means. My face is oily. That means my brows are oily, but the brow products are still staying in place. This is doing so well without brow gel. I see you. <laughs> so I just came out of the shower and my eyebrows are still on. You know, sometimes when you go traveling and you have a whole day of like excursions, you just want to have like a quick body shower before you go out for dinner. And yeah, I just feel so amazing now. And the aircon's on as well. And I'm just like, yeah. I am honestly loving brow styler from Benefit. I'm just trying to think how this can compare to the Precisely My Brow. Like the Precisely My Brow is literally just a pencil as this is like a two-in-one. So I feel like it's good value for money because you get two different brow products in one component and I just think that's really good because that means it could potentially last you longer. But yeah, I'm going to do another check-in later on in the evening and then I'm going to do a water test as well. Also guys, I forgot to tell you and I forgot to record it. Um, it was one of those things where I just did it by accident. Basically, I accidentally touched my brows. I think I had like a little itch or something. I just went like this and I was like, oh shit, I have eyebrows on. And I looked at my fingers, there was like no transfer. So that's a really good sign. Me and Nathan are going to go to a curry house. Oh yes. 
so excited to eat because I'm so hungry and my eyebrow is so itchy but I like I want to scratch it I think I'll just scratch it just a little bit I'll just tap it tap it <gasps> no transfer here we are the curry place that Nathan found a restaurant that says cow cow which is my cat's name so our table's over here the chef's cooking oh yes i love this type of restaurant oh my god guys okay so this menu is so good so you pick what type of curry paste thingy you want and then you select how many grams of rice you want and then you select how spicy you want it and everything this is so good and what's down here favorite oh okay this is so cool i love this i feel like we don't have this in england oh my god Deep fry that, oh yeah. Get in my belly. Oh my god guys, okay, so this is the curry part. And then over here, you walk over and you get yourself a book. So these are mangoes. Here it is guys, I got myself a pork curry with some chicken cutlets with some cheese. Don't judge, okay? I love cheese and curry. If you haven't tried cheese and curry, you gotta try it, okay? It's delicious. And then over here, I've got myself a potato and then Nathan got some chicken stew with rice. Yummy. <laughs> that was delicious and now i'm gonna fill my belly up even more by having some ice cream okay so i walked outside to show you all what the restaurant is called that i am getting my dessert so that is what it's called don't have to say yet and then you walk in and then you got all this fake food oh yes so I thought it'd be fun to get like the weirdest ice cream. So I got this one right here. It sounds very exotic and very Asian. Can't wait to try it. I really hope I like this. The best way to describe this is that this is a very Asian dessert. You know what I mean. This is squidgy. Mm. The jet lag is so real. Don't mind this one sleeping over here. Um, I have a few officially had these eyebrows on for almost 18 hours not quite 18 hours i want to say about 16 hours and guys i'm ready to go sleep we got one more test to do i want to make sure that these eyebrows are definitely waterproof so i'm going to go ahead get some water i'm going to play around with the eyebrows you don't know what this is this is a little water spray oh yeah oh. I'm gonna use this to test out how waterproof these eyebrows are. Okay, guys. Oh, what's going on? Why is she so small? Oh, yeah. Got a little bit of tissue. Oh, some products came off. Let's try this side because this has got brow gel. Oh, wow. So product did come off, but this one stayed on way more. You know, considering that I've had this eyebrow product on for about 16 hours and my skin is so oily, it still stayed on pretty well. I mean, I'm not mad. I'm gonna keep it real if you are. Wow, my bra. Okay guys, final verdict. Is this brow product worth it or not? I wanna say yeah. And the only reason why is because you get two brow products in one. And I think that's really good value for money as well. Well, you got one side powder and the other side of pencils. It's two completely different products as well. So one pencil, one side powder. Powder can really help make your eyebrows look natural and pencil can really help them make your eyebrows look a little bit more defined and a little bit out there. In terms of longevity, I feel like this brow product stayed on for a really long time considering I've been out and about walking and so humid here in Kyoto. It's definitely worth it and I cannot wait to wear it more often. If you guys are interested in checking out this press, I'll leave a link down below in the description box just in case you guys want to check it out. I am ready for bed. I feel like a mess. I need to wash my face because it does not feel clean at all. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I really hope that this video helped you guys out. More videos to come, so make sure you subscribe and click that bell button as well. And I will see you in the next one. Bye!